Colorado MMA. I am here with Dr. Alex Constantinidis, founder of the Never Alone Foundation. Dr. Alex is widely known as Colorado's fight doc and one of the most endeared members of our community. Doc, the Never Alone Foundation is obviously in your family's honor. Tell us a little bit about this wonderful foundation. Um, we're a brand new foundation this year, just launching. Um, as you said, it's an honor of my wife and three children. For those that don't know, um, my wife dedicated her work as a social worker to international adoption, helping families adopt. Her. My three children were adopted, two from China and one from India. Wanted to uh, carry on their legacy of love and carry on their name. Uh, and so we've created the uh, Never Alone Foundation. We uh, give grants in three areas. We help with the expense of adoption. Mm -hmm. We help with paying for post-adoption counseling uh, for families that are having issues with bonding post-adoption. Sure. And we um, help pay medical bills for medical special needs adoptions. All the most, impo most expensive parts of this. Right. Exactly. And obviously, uh, Family Jam is on June 1st. Yeah, the, the first annual Never Alone Family Jam, June 1st. Yes. Lakewood Heritage Center, Outdoor Amphitheater uh, here in Denver, and super excited, super excited. All day event, though. Let's all, make that clear. From 10 to event. 6. Starts at 10 o'clock. Band's probably going to go a little bit even after 6. So, <laughs> of course. Um, but really family-friendly event. That's all I do. We got bouncy houses and face painting and bubble stations. Bring the and kids. Arts. Bring your family. Yeah. Come for a couple bands. Come for the whole day if you want. But uh, we want this to be about family. Agreed. That's what we're all about is family. And, and come and, and just have a good time and uh, learn more about adoption or just uh, come have a good time with your family and help support adoption for Absolutely. someone else. Absolutely. And obviously, you know, we're going to see some growth out of the foundation. What are, you, uh, what are you expecting to see out of this in the next five years? We'd like to um, be able to give grants on a quarterly basis in all three of our granting areas. Um, and, you know, that means you have to constantly raise money. Yes. Year-round, multiple events, and, and you really have to grow and get your name out, which we plan to. But more than just the granting, we really want to be a, a, a focal point for international adoption. We want to be the focus of the community adoption. We want people to be able to come to the Never Alone Foundation to make connections, either getting started in the adoption process, getting connected with adoption agencies, helping decide what country they would consider adopting from, helping each other through the adoption process, helping each other after the adoption process. There's so much that goes into, into raising an adoptive family. Unbelievable. And sometimes you feel like you're alone, but you're not. Right. You're never alone. Right. And come together, be together, help each other out. There's people who are in front of you, who've been through it, there's people behind you that are getting ready to go do it, and if we all help each other out, that's what we want to be. So more than just the granting, we want to be that focal point for international adoption. I love it. Tell us about how we can contact the foundation. A couple different ways to contact the foundation. If you're on Facebook, search for the Never Alone Foundation. Uh, website is www.laurelsmessage, all one word, L-A-U-R-E-L-S-M-E-S-S-A-G-E dot org, and you can also email at director at laurels message.org. Dr. Alex, I cannot put into words how much we love you here. This is an emotional moment for me, but I want you to know that you have the full support of the MMA community here. I can't thank you enough. I, I know I have their support. They show it to me every day, and I love you guys a lot. Thank you. Thank you very much.